But thankfully, YouTube is still putting videos in front of all of you, and you have questions and discussions. And our first discussion uh, comes in from uh, Stephanie McKeon based on something I posted on my Facebook group. So as I was uh, out researching some questions to ask Elias about the Amazon ecosystem, I was surprised to learn that Amazon has taken the number two place of tablet manufacturers worldwide, uh, second only to Apple. In fact, they just knocked off Samsung. And Stephanie was surprised they're not number one with all the bundle sales that they've been doing uh, with their tablets lately. Uh, there's a great article on VentureBeat that kind of summarizes the last quarter of this year where Amazon uh, beat out Samsung. They had a significant amount of growth in their uh, market share with their tablets. And there's no surprise as to why that is. Uh, you can get the seven inch tablet now for $40. I reviewed this a little while ago. It's pretty functional. In fact, my daughter uses the one on the far right there with the uh, big bumper on it. Uh, the, the kids version is pretty much the same as the uh, regular $40 version, but they give you a warranty that includes damage for two years. It's a really good deal given that the kid is likely going to break it. Surprisingly, uh, this tablet has been dropped and caked with yogurt and all sorts of stuff, and it is still fully functional. It has yet to break despite the fact that this thing gets a beating. Uh, so they put, put together some pretty nice little tablets. We reviewed the Fire HD 10 a couple of months ago, and that one was also very impressive. And again, very reasonably priced devices here that are significantly less expensive than the iPad. And what's really surprising to me is that despite how expensive the iPad is, Apple is still shipping a lot of them. But look at the market growth here. Uh, Apple only grew about 0.6%. Uh, over the fourth quarter in the prior year. Remember, the fourth quarter is the holiday season where most people buy this kind of stuff. So it gives you a really good indication as to where consumer interest lies. And here you can see Amazon uh, growing their market share by 50%. So that holiday bundling that they did uh, certainly made a huge impact. And I think they are going places. It's funny, too, that Amazon using uh, the Android OS as the kind of base base operating system of their device is able to do something Google cannot do. In fact, Google uh, is no longer listing tablets on their store anymore because there just isn't enough interest in them to continue that part of the Android market. But Amazon clearly figured out a way to do it. This channel is brought to you by the Lon.TV supporters, including gold level supporters of the Black Eyed and Blues Music Hour podcast, Chris Allegretta, Tom Albrecht and Kalyan Kumar. If you want to help the channel, you can by contributing as little as a dollar a month. Head over to lon.tv slash support to learn more. And don't forget to subscribe. Visit lon.tv slash s.